like NFTs. That's okay hey, too, man. but all Any interest I ask in that? is give them a shot. Yeah. Hopefully, we can talk a little bit about why. Yeah. <laughs> From the silver packs? Yeah. Damn, dude. <laughs> uh, I'm asking 3K on it. Yeah. Uh, I run a media company. <laughs> I didn't know if you'd be interested. I know you're a cave guy. Yeah. Uh, we have a podcast <laughs> where we talk about Ryan. We, we just provide Ryan support. I don't know if we had that much. Uh, oh, I really like that word. <laughs> I'd be open to like part trade too. NFT. I think about it like the cloud. So and there was What's going on YouTube? I am back with another video and this one's gonna be day four, which is actually the last day of the national for me. So today is Saturday. Uh, I actually have to leave the show around one o'clock and catch the train uh, back to Philly and then uh, fly home later on tonight. So um, the show does start at 10, only gonna have about three hours today. So um, not really sure what to expect today. Again, I know I've mentioned the box battles a ton of times, but uh, you just don't know, you know, what Panini is going to choose for those box battles. Uh, and yesterday, the the only time I was really free was for the Obsidian one, which was $700, and I didn't want to do that. So uh, we'll see if I can maybe catch a box battle today. Um, honestly, kind of want to rip some more of those Topps National Packs uh, because I actually looked at some on eBay, and those cards are actually selling for pretty good amounts, especially that Julio Rodriguez. So... Might pick up another box to uh, maybe get another couple uh, tops and national packs. So not really sure what to expect today. Just going to kind of, you know, again, go for a few hours. Maybe hopefully, you know, make some uh, nice last minute pickups. So, uh, yeah, I guess uh, we'll go ahead and head over to the show and I'll check back in once we get there. So checking in from the show on day four, just checked out the Tops booth because again, I think one of the things I definitely want to do today is grab a couple more of those Tops national packs. Uh, but the show just opened at 10 and that line is absolutely insane. Uh, that's honestly the longest I've seen it for those Tops packs. So we're gonna hold off a little bit. Hopefully that'll shorten up later in the day. And I'm actually gonna go check the schedule for the box wars today. So we'll see how that's looking. And then hopefully at some point a little later, we'll maybe get some Tops national packs. All right, guys, so we are officially in for the next box war. The first one of the day was actually Chronicles H2, which is a product that I really enjoy. So definitely wanted to get on this one. Plus, it's not too expensive. Uh, it's 200 bucks a box here. So we went ahead and grabbed a box. It is a little bit after 10, so we got about 20, <clears throat> excuse me, 20 minutes until the box war. So I'm just going to hang out and wait for that. So the winning card is going to be the highest serial number on the left for a quarterback. So we got Zach Wilson, but that's just a silver, not going to be numbered. Yeah, I just didn't want her doing it four seconds before we started. Uh, Elijah Moore, not a quarter. Ooh. Oh my gosh, we just got trolled. That was a backwards T law. Thought we hit a T law auto there. All right, so no serial number quarterbacks on that one. Nico. Oh, Jack. I got 179. That's really good. Yeah. I got 179. All right, right. Uh. <laughs> oh, 
I just got, got beaten immediately. Aaron Rodgers, be numbered. Come on. Oh wow, number to beat is 199. T-Law. Uh, that one's not gonna be a quarterback. Another one that's not a quarterback, we got Ojalari, Justin Fields. So, not looking good. Can I take a cross? Sure. Thank you. Gotta be 199 here. Oh, we got Prism Black. That's Kenneth Gainwell. Another T Law. Tyler Trey Sermon. Yeah, not gonna beat it. Not gonna beat it. Did you win? Did you win? I did. What did you win? I won. So you pick a disc out of the bag, and then it's correlated to something in the right, case. Right, right, right. And this is what I my number was immaculate. UFC. Oh, it's UFC? Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah, you probably about to Frank. Oh, yeah, yeah. Are you ripping it right now? Yeah. Oh, now you care if I record it? No. All right, guys, so here with the winner of the uh, the box where I, I was actually 179, so I was kind of close. Uh, I yeah. got excited there <laughs> for a minute. It was 318. Yeah, that, yeah. She that should, was, she, it should be our second win. I didn't realize she won the first time. Oh, are you serious? A couple days ago, yeah. Oh, wow. All right, I'll get you out there. <laughs> well, good luck, Boo Redemption. Thank you. Okay. I don't really know too much about Me UFC either, other than like Conor McGregor, Patty Pimble. Right. <laughs> oh, you're getting something good. You're getting something good here. You got a redemption coming. 101, Kobe Covington. Nice. Oh, no way. Kobe Covington. I think that's a, I think that's a wow. top two redemption. It's really, uh, that's a good one. Who is it? There's these. Oh, I didn't say his name. Oh, that's top tier. <laughs> and Izzy and Yon do it. No, yeah, that's no, a really good one. Congrats. Congrats. Man, that, do you want to go change the That is a very nice uh, autograph. That, that cold cup is nice too. That's uh, really cool. One of that one. is top tier right there. Go change that in for a black box over there. All right, guys, so just finished up the box war. Got a little bit excited there for a minute. I pulled that DAC. Uh, thought I had a chance, but then ended up getting crushed. The top serial number on the left was like 300 something, so I had no shot. And then the lady that actually won the box battle got an immaculate UFC box, ripped it immediately, pulled an uh, Adesanya Redemption and a Colby Covington one of one, I believe. So absolutely insane. Those, uh, the box war prizes are legit. So unfortunately we couldn't win, but definitely a lot of fun. All right, guys, so just walking around, kind of decided I'm actually going to shop this one around a little bit, the Cade 101. I did actually go ahead and list it on eBay. Just going to kind of listen to offers, see if anyone's interested. And I was actually just walking around and came across some super random cards, but cards I thought were pretty good, you know, pretty cheap, pretty good deals. So I picked up a Joe Montana White Sparkle and a Cole Anthony Spectra RPA. Got those for $160, so thought that was a really good deal. And we're gonna continue shopping around the Cade, see if anyone's interested. All right, guys, so I've been shopping that Cade around for close to an hour now and not having much luck. Uh, pretty much all the dealers are saying, super nice card, congrats on the pool, uh, but just not interested right now. And I think a lot of it is probably due to, uh, it's not basketball season, basketball is not very high right now. Um, you know, football is a little bit closer, uh, it's definitely way more popular here at the show. So probably just going to stick with it on eBay, see what offers I get. Uh, but the line is actually a lot shorter over at the Tops booth now. So I'm going to grab another box and then hopefully go get some uh, more Tops um, uh, silver packs or whatever it is. So uh, that's the plan right now. And we'll probably rip those once we do like the, uh, the pickups video. So those will be coming in the future. All right, so we were about to buy up Tops box to get some of those packs like I just mentioned. Uh, but the guys said that they're actually out of those, the national packs for today. They'll be back tomorrow. But there was a line over here a minute ago. So I'm gonna go double check and make sure that's accurate uh, before we actually pick that box up. Okay, well, unfortunately, the Tops National Packs are sold out for today. They'll be back tomorrow at 10 a.m. I guess they a lot a certain amount per day. So I guess I should have waited in that line earlier, but uh, that's okay. Now I don't have to buy a $200 box. So uh, we're not gonna have any more Tops National Packs. In either or. 
If you're here for your cards, awesome. Continue to do that. If you like NFTs or you don't like NFTs, that's okay hey, too. Man. But all Any interest I ask in that? is give them a shot. Yeah. Hopefully, we can talk a little bit about why. Yeah. <laughs> From the silver packs? Yeah. Damn, dude. <laughs> uh, I'm asking 3K on it. Yeah. Uh, I run a media company. <laughs> I didn't know if you'd be interested. I know you're a cave guy. Uh, we have a podcast. Wait, Ryan, do we, we just have provide Ryan support. I don't know if we had that much. Uh, oh, I really like that word. <laughs> I'd be open to like part trade too. I think about it like cloud. So and there was like an 18 month window where uh, millions and millions of people were going to buy a Trey Lance auto. That's pretty tempting. New tech called the cloud, and everyone was making fun of people uh, that they were living think on the think cloud. Think on it for a bit. Uh, okay. Your uh, channel is. Uh, are you following too? Yeah. All right, yeah. They all think you have before. Yeah, I. uh I'm actually catching a train oh, in like an here? hour. Oh. So, I mean, if you want to think about it for a little bit. So if you're still here and I, I have to pick you up, we'll, you know, Yeah, for sure. Yeah, just uh, DM me. I'll, I'll check on Instagram. Cool, I'll keep in mind. Thanks okay, yeah, for sure, man. Good we'll talking to you. You'd be interested in that at all? It's a one-on-one? What is it? What is that? Uh, it's of the silver packs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got, I got super lucky. I sold all my silver packs. Did you? Yeah, I got gotcha. you. I appreciate it. Don't buy it at all. I was just shopping that one around. It's a one of one. Yeah, I'll try it. Okay. I literally haven't even been leaving this morning. 502, man. I seen your video last that's night. Me, that's yeah. awesome. Thank you. I appreciate oh, it. Yeah. What are you, <laughs> what are you thinking <laughs> on it? You don't know. I'm so asking for, but I'm just kind of seeing if anyone's interested. I can't you, uh... I don't have any of my you looking for anything? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I was, I would actually be down to do like part cash, part trade. Uh, I only got a couple, man. Oh, you want to take a look? For sure. Yeah, let's do it, man. Uh, around 12. So, 1200. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it, it's out of 49. It's, right. I think that's low because here, I, I once sold for 29, I once sold for 27, sold. then once sold for 13, and then once sold for 11, 20. Oh, so they've come down a lot. Yeah. yeah. Now. Uh, you know, I'm. Uh, what what about the KD? About I haven't looked it up. I, to be honest, I looked it up real quick. I, but when I last did, it was around six hundred. Six hundred. Okay, so. Oh, uh, let's see. Twelve and six. Um, I mean, how much cash would you be willing to do on the KD? You know. I would honestly. Are you looking at? Are you looking at both those cards? That those are the two that caught my eye. Yeah. This is a pop three. I mean, I don't know if you like, but that's the, a pop three. Quickly. I I, I, yeah, I graded it. I, oh, I, did you? Yeah. I, okay. I, so I I mean, we're all selling on that card for about a hundred and seventy. So okay. I. I'm being super fair on this price in that car. Because I think 400. I mean, I really think it could sell it for six. On that quickly? Yeah. And I'm being. I'm, yeah, if, I'm just. If you're not interested, I'm. I, I'm just not big. I'm super big on quickly. Okay, no, no worries. Um, now, I know you don't have much, much in that, but that doesn't matter because it's so good. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's a one of one. Yeah, it's a one of one. I would like to do these two. Thousand bucks. Uh, so that'd be that'd be twenty six hundred for it. Six. You know, one of ones are a pain in the ass to sell. <laughs> they, yeah, they are because they're so subjective. So okay, I was thinking twelve hundred cash. You want to? I, I would do those two. I, well, have you looked at the condition on the Mac at all? Like, there's no issues or anything. No, I. I, I you care if I pull it out? Pull it Just, out. Pull it out of the sleeve. But I was uh, I was originally thinking these two at twelve hundred. So you said a thousand. So maybe meet in the middle at eleven. I'm in the middle at eleven. Okay. Make a video about it. Oh man. I mean, I'm in this. <laughs> I'm in this for a hundred bucks. Uh, let's do it. Thousand. Eleven. Is that? 
Cause you, I was thinking 12 and then I thought you said 11 was cool. Yeah, because I watch your channel, man. All right, I appreciate it. All right, wow. I wouldn't, ex I wouldn't expect that. <laughs> yeah, I got All right. All right, guys, checking back in real quick. We were actually just doing, kind of doing one more walkthrough again. Been shopping the Kate around uh, the past couple hours. Uh, just before I head home, see if I got any offers, if anyone's interested. And as I was shopping that around, uh, someone came up to me and they were like, you know, what are you asking on it? Uh, so we have... We have JR over here with us, and we actually just made a deal for the one of one Cade. Uh, so we are going to do a KD Kaboom, a Mac Jones Purple Power Auto, and 1100 cash for the one of one Cade Cunningham. Cade Cunningham. So the Cade now has a new home. Uh, so let us know what you think about the deal in the comments. We're both worried that we're both going to get roasted. So <laughs> yeah. I appreciate yeah. the deal, man. Hey, thanks a lot. All right. All right, guys. Here with Nash cards. As you guys know, they bought out the last 10. Uh, they want me to go ahead and rip them. I guess, what's the plan here? Are you, are you just going to open them up and sell them? Out of sure. What do you mean? What, what do you want us to do with them? Keep them? Keep, <laughs> keepsakes? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so I'm, I'm going to rip some 502 fire packs. Here we go. All right, here we go, guys. First pack. Come on, Frank. Feels raw. Don't let me down. Donovan Mitchell, first off the line, green shimmer, 25. Is it greenable? I'm about to head to SGC. I don't know, you tell me. <laughs> Looks pretty centered. Pack number two. Right. Oh, what I tell there you, what I tell you. I knew it, I knew it was still in there. What is it? John Morant, Morant PSA 10. There we go. That'll go good in the Memphis. 100, 150, 150 plus. Let's see if y'all got the Luca too. There's a Luca status orange PSA 10 that I never saw. Another jaw, another jaw right. PSA 10. Some Memphis bags here. <laughs> Pack number four, raw. Luca, Luca uh, Emerald to 88. Love that card. Like that. that one's gradable. I know that one's gradable. That's pretty crazy. These are south. These are the actual lowest. LeBron. Okay. NBA City. That one's uh, that one's probably maybe the lowest so far. Let me think about. I'll probably circle back around. Even if I don't take it, I'll circle back around. Jordan Wara, out of the PC. Panini one and one RPA. Yes, we got Frank PC. <laughs> All right, maybe that one straight, stays. Straight from the PC. Maybe that one stays. All right. SGC. That's cool. Lamella. Can't go wrong there. That's how we like that. Huh? Stuff that's easy to move. Three more. PSA? Is this the Luca? Luca! Oh, but it's not the stat. But Luca, rookie PSA 10. That's good? Yeah. How's it going? Yeah, how are you? I'm tired. <laughs> All right, pack number nine. We've got two left. Uh, Zion. Zion. Is, I like that brand. Yeah, I love that. Yeah, I love that. Last one. Here we go. Bill's SGC. Oh, and pretty Simons. Hyper Simon. Pinks. That one's got to be super low. Like, pop. Those are super tough. So. What, 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 awesome. what are we thinking? Awesome. I love this brand. I think we did pretty good. Absolutely. Yeah. Huh? I appreciate it, guys. <laughs> All right, guys, and that is going to do it for day four, and that is going to also do it for the trip at the National. So super exciting into the trip. Was not expecting to actually uh, move that Cade, uh, but again, you guys saw the deal. Someone uh, randomly saw me shopping it around, and we were actually able to make a deal, which I was pretty surprised about. Uh, but I got to actually head over to the train, train station now. Definitely want to uh, make sure I don't miss the train. So this is going to end it on day four, and I should have probably one or two more videos definitely a uh, national pickup video coming soon so be on the lookout for that uh so yeah we're gonna wrap this one up here hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you soon